We're back, everybody. With more... Not Fine. Class 7. Nope. You're in Wild Arms Weekend! Which is coming to a quick close. We're in the final dungeon now. Invisible still gets zapped by lightning. <laughs> it's a pressure plate. It's fine. Fine. It's fine. <laughs> this place is. It's very puzzle heavy, as you would expect from the you know final dungeon of the game. Yeah. And it's got it's got some homies here. Got some homies. Yeah, these homies can do some damage. Not a whole lot of damage, but some. Oh, that's right, Cecilia's faster than Jack now. Oh, and they actually have some HP too. So Jack actually can't one-shot them all now. System malfunction. Primary defensive line deactivated. Shifting to emergency status. Oh. Fat fingers. Oh. Oh, wait. I think these things have a good steel item. Oh. Yeah, I think I can still stab boosting apples from these guys or something. And now we go over here, because I think there's another security system this way. Czar's eye. And vessel side. Powerful blow. Blah. That was pretty damaging, but not too bad. Now 
Now I need more money. Like a lot more money. That is Rudy's most powerful arm. And it is not cheap to upgrade. I'm going to need to farm some hail contents. There's a lever. Do you want to use it? Yes, I do. I got the guitar. The guitar, the guitar Jack acquired is called the Guitar of Maya. You can call any monsters around you into a fight right away. You want to see Jack rock out on the guitar? Uh, yes. It's, it's only use is to call is to get into a fight instantly. Uh oh. Well, I can't say it's only use, but it's uh, it's you. It's used for doing literally one thing, and it's not even in this dungeon. Is he gonna use it to try to get his girl back? He might. He, he plays some pretty pitching tunes. <laughs> Although, here's the thing every time he plays it, monsters appear. Yeah, so, that's bad. So it's kind of a double edged sword. Oh, that one's immune to light. How much money do I have? Probably not enough to upgrade what I need to upgrade. Can I use escape here? Yes, I can. I can't remember if I can use the guitar in the overworld or not. Nope. That's gonna make life a little, a little annoying. I 
Alright. I fully upgraded Rudy's arm in terms of damage, ammo, and some accuracy. Now it's time to go try and do the stuff. Oop, I fucked that up. Walk too far ahead. So, you may notice we're not in Balduk anymore. We're trying to go to the Abyss. Oh. And it's something that I could never get to trigger because it's random. But the trick to getting the abyss oh, is hitting the pedestal that the teleporter is on with the punch glove. And then getting into the teleporter while it's shaking. I can't remember if I need to progress into Maldu further to do that. Oh, nope, there we go. Mountain, El Elwoo Pyramid malfunction. Instead of taking me to the other Elwoo Pyramid, it takes me to the Abyss. The Abyss is a prison. This is where the darkest evil dwells. The vortex of this dark prison will engulf anyone who goes near it. Oh, that's the way out. Alright. Welcome to this 100 floor dungeon. Oh, oh, I did not know that. Yeah, it's 100 floors. You can't save. A sword of light will slay the darkness. The jewel of the future will lead us to the absolute truth. Yeah, at least I think this version's 100 floors. And it's got the most powerful enemies in the game in it. got the strongest non-boss enemies in the game. As you can see, this guy's taking a beating. And they give a lot of experience and money. It's got puzzles. Gamazine. Yeah, I've never even been in this dungeon before. So I don't know what's here. I mean I know what I know what's here, I just don't know what else. I also didn't realize it would make my screen dark on this first area. Uh. A sword of light will slay the darkness. The jewel of the future will lead us to the absolute truth. I feel like I'm missing something. I am definitely missing something.
Oh. The radar tells you which switches to flip. I never would have thought to use that. I don't think this is the 100 floor version of it. But I know in the third game in Alter Code F it is 100 unsavable floors, so I don't know how this version is. This just might be an actual discussion. The darkest path is the one that leads to the depths. The path of the unseen is the path of darkness. Oh yeah, it also requires two duplicators to actually progress all the way in here. So these are some of the best helms in the game. Cowboy Jack gets the Texas number. Yeah. Rudy gets him there some dead heat. Yeah, buddy. And then she gets the Ruby Tiara. The path of the unseen is the path of darkness. I think I know what it's trying to tell me. This thing looks like light flight element. No, it's not light element. I go um and he goes chum. Um dum chum chum. This will be fine. Jack num bang. Yeah, I'm still kind of fucking reeling from having to use the damn radar to find the order of the switches that need to be to find the switches that need to be flipped. Right. 
not where I want it to fall. The darkest pass path is the one that leads to the depths. The path of the unseen is the path of darkness. What do you mean, the path of the unseen? Looks like he can be moved to darkness. Nah.
not water gun. Oh my goodness. Bloody roll, bud. Yeah. Yep. It's unfortunate because I actually absolutely need what these enemies can have stolen from them. Uh, unfortunate. Okay, well they claim they can drop them, so this is good too. And it fucking lied. King of Frost and King of Flame. I will be right back. That's fine, I'm gonna fucking fight those guys multiple times. That didn't do... that didn't do at all. That's not what Oh, these are strong dudes. Magic carrots. I sell that damn thing. No.
damn it, Rudy. Need one of them, so I'm gonna keep playing the guitar till I get the item that I need off them. All right, so I did the stealing. Those Wojanoids give you drop frog matches. These are incredibly vital. It's Crowley. I can't have that much hit points. can't light this room up because it'll close the door because you have to go on the path of darkness. Which is the true path. Okay, Fat Fingers. You wanna play Fat Fingers the game? We'll play Fat Fingers. The power of this beast has no match in this world. The beast, the beast king, Rago Ragla, comes from the sea of stars. Dripping with might, this white beast towers over you like a tornado. Oh, 
come on, fat fingers. Thank you. One time I actually didn't want it this long. I use high blast. I know it's still I got it. Hit him with the stairs. My oxygen. No. My breathing. All I know is fine dining in that. Yeah, without the Necronomicon, that does like no damage. Getting some good experience and stuff here. There's a few chests in here that have extra items in here, but I don't, I don't really care too much about any of the normal stuff. What the fuck is that? Yeah, what the fuck is that? Don't know. Two times attack, 75% of the time. That's kind of cool. Huh. Is it only a one-use item? No, it's an equip item. Oh, I see. Hmm. I thought... And it's a Rudy exclusive equip item. To make his basic attack deal double damage more more frequently. Because reasons, I guess. Mystic Slate is 50% extra max MP. I guess Rudy can have that equipped until I'm ready to actually fight the boss. It would have been great if Jack could equip that. gonna be a bit of a longer one because I bring in all the stuff we did here.
shit about it. How? How? Like... Very careful, precise with this shit. Paralysis Club. Club Paralysis. Yeah. <laughs> and, and here's the last oh. door. And here's the last door for the big bad. I'm gonna say that reminded me of like our unga bungas. <laughs> yeah. This is the central core. This is where Raggle Raggle sleeps under its spell. Once awakened by the song of the Maya, the world will burn to cinders. Huh, the song of the Maya. Could that have anything to do with the guitar of Maya we got? Ram, do it up. Kill them, kitty cat ball of energy death. He's dancing. He's got old cartoony sounds. He's Looney Tuning. Gotta wake up the King of Beasts from space with a guitar.
Okay. So we're gonna make an extra. S we're gonna make an alternate save here. Oh. <clears throat> Again, just for posterity's sake, I want to show you why stealing those frog badges was so fucking important. So I have to play the Song of the Maya to awaken the sleeping king of all dead. So this is Ragu Regula. Oh. Jack! Jack is hyper! Hyper he is! Jack is hyper! So, this attack volcanic bomb is basically a party wipe. Oh. Yeah. That's basically a party wipe. It's a fire elemental attack that'll pretty much just kill the entire party right then and there. But wow. with those, yeah, with those frog badges I stole, I am completely immune to fire damage. Oh. Which makes that attack do nothing. So that's why stealing those badges is so damn important. Yeah, sometimes he'll just start with it and just say, nope, you don't get the win this time. But with the frog badges on, it does no damage. And that's his signature attack. So... Without being able to just kill me with Volcanic Bomb, he's actually incredibly easy. The other way to beat him is just bring 99 Goat Dolls and just have everybody equip a Goat Doll every turn. That's the other way to win. Because other than that, he has Poison Breath, which can poison everybody but do no damage. And zero armor attack, which does like 3,000 damage, which we can easily heal up. And that only hits one person, too.
I don't know why I did so much more damage to Rudy than I did to Jack. Yeah, without the frog badges, he is fucking ridiculously hard. With frog badges, he ain't nothing. Yeah, friggin' volcanic bomb literally kills your whole party because it does like 6,000 damage to everybody. And I don't know if you noticed, but my party's only got it doesn't. It has my everybody in my party has less than five thousand life. But oh. with that, yeah, they do. Yeah. Ooh. But with that, we get the sheriff star, which raises all of your stats by one hundred and protects you from like everything. That, that's the abyss done. Hardest boss in the game tackled. That is crazy. Yeah. He just gets to decide if you get to keep fighting him or not. Like, sometimes you'll get lucky and he'll just decide, oh, I won't use Volcanic Bomb a single time. Other times, he'll spam the damn thing. That good old RNG. <laughs> good old RNG. Good old ring. All right. That's all for this time, everybody. Next time. Till next. Mall Duke and the end of the game.